Well, this is it. Our journey has come to its end. Our lives, as we know them, are over. What? Golly, we're adults now! <laughs> no, 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 seriously though. I just wanted to say thanks for coming out, fellow breathers. We are officially college graduates. So congrats, monkeys. There's beer in the pool, uh, condoms in the fridge. And if you can't be careful, there's a clinic like three blocks down. They'll do you cheap if you give them our promo code. Okay, we came, we saw. If we leave now, we can still make the donut place. Let's go before Lola, we get recognized. Milo. I almost didn't recognize you. Hi, Allison. Can you believe we graduated? And... to end school than with an indigenous late century style mixer coupled with property damage and substance abuse. Well. Oh, I love that, that y your outfit, Lola. You're always doing your own thing, which, you know, which I love. Yeah, this is, it's fun, right? I kept telling Lola we should have hung up with you guys more. Then why didn't you? You don't need me to go, we're not each other's sidekicks. Because he needs his wingman, wing human. Who wants to get drunk? Let's get a drink, like right now. Come on, the table's right, it's here. Oh, whatever speeds this process up. Oh, and I'm sorry, this is my cousin, Katie. She's gonna be starting here in the fall. Hey. I was just telling her about you guys, how you've been friends forever, like a weirdly long time. Everyone always thinks you're dating. <laughs> no, 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 never ever. Uh, I know now, but ever. Why would they, why would they think that? Think that you're screwing? <laughs> I mean, somebody has to fuck the next generation of internet stars into existence. Let's drink, come on, they have them right over here. Are we getting that drink, Milo? Hi, is this, is this where the, uh, the ales are? It's all $2 vodka mixed with $3 lemonade. Want one? Yes, please. Milo, Lola? Uh, it really helps pave over those awkward beats in the conversation. You could almost say it literally gives you more options in life. It's evolutionary, you know? I read somewhere that monkey humans invented alcohol. Yeah, I, I probably need something to, uh, to settle me a little. Don't get too settled. I'm not dragging your ass through the quad ever again. That shady chiropractor said my skeleton looked like a question mark. Yeah, so, do you guys want one? They're getting warm. Do we want one? Uh, no thanks. I'll stick with air. <laughs> You'll regret that. Seriously, there's some shit coming later. Lola? I uh, always pass if Milo passes, or drink if he does. He does the same for me. Makes it so we can lie to each other about how drunk we're getting. <laughs> Attention! All skin bags do not have to pay taxes. Please make your way to the dance floor. It's time to shake. <laughs> okay, really quick, give Katie meaningful life advice about higher learning. Mine was don't major in philosophy, law, any form of medicine, or theology, because those are all career suicide. Oh, and don't buy your books from the campus store. You don't want the clerk there knowing your pin number. Uh, generally just try not to... Uh... Yeah, that's good, thanks. Keep in touch. Allison Haynes, ladies and gentlemen. Like, why would anyone think we're... I was just as confused as you were. No, it's fine. Allison's just an idiot. Can't wait to read her posts about her summer vacay. <laughs> Drinking pina coladas out of some cruise boat magician's navel. Well, whatever. I'm not gonna let that be the last meaningful conversation you ever have at school. No, if you wanna go, we can go. Oh, no, 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 no. We're leaving. This is us just saying bye to some folks on our way out the door. So pick whoever looks the least stupid and make this quick. <laughs> you crack me up, though. Yeah, Allison. I keep telling stupid Lola how fun uh, parties are. Hey, Billy? Are. Can we maybe... Uh, how about we change the music up? I, I can't, actually. They only made one song for the DJ. What does that mean? I mean, yeah, sure thing. Just after this one's done. You're out. Want another drink? Lola, do you want to maybe... Dance? Fuck off. I think we need another drink if we're going to keep talking. Like, have you ever thought that what you consider your personality is, is just the dream your unconscious body is having? Because I have. And all my teachers said I was very smart. <laughs> wow, that's 
That's deep, man. If I was scuba diving, I'd need time to stop the nosebleed. Sorry, this is Lola. I'm Milo. I think I... Didn't we have the same advanced frisbee class in... I know who you are. You're the one that gave blood and then immediately threw up all over the auditorium in the annex. That... it wasn't that bad. <laughs> no, it was pretty bad. <laughs> yeah, that... that story just didn't go away, did it? Talk about a bad first day. First impressions matter a lot. Kappa Sigma gave you a nickname, right? The Recycler? Chunkamunk. Or was it Colonel Shitlips? Well, it was nice catching up. Have a great summer. Bye. That? Okay, I know that could have gone better. Shitlips. I mean, Milo. <laughs> Who cares, man? Seriously, they're just being dickbags. Well, it doesn't feel that way. It feels like I'm a freshly born antelope just learning how to walk. I should know how to make adult friends by now. You just make it so much harder than it has to be. Okay, Sven fucking Ghoulie. You, you go and talk to people and, and, and teach me. Show me the ropes. Let's... I, I want to see how easy it is. Hey, if that's what you want. My trick is just remembering that everybody's born screaming in terror. Whatever it takes. Go forth and show me how it's done. Looks like you're running on fumes. Want to get another drink? No, 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 no. When, when the guy was all, not today, and then the smoking hot chick was all, uh... Right? And those effects! Oh, I couldn't even tell those were in his head. <gasps> and the score? Oh, if he doesn't get his Oscar. Talking about a movie? Let me guess, it was rated PG-13 for fantasy violence. Actually, you can say ass twice and still get the PG. I'm Lola. This is... Colonel Shitlips. We got it. Oh, come on. I... That was... Lola, did you say? Are you auditing a student or... shadowing some classes? David, I gave you the Heimlich two years ago. I met your parents in the hospital. Remember, they kept touching my hair? Uh, wait, uh, you went to this school or you're going to this school? Okay, well, good to see you guys. Keep it... keep it up. Bye, Lip Flaps! Bye, Ebola! Milo, you wanted to mingle. Why are you sheepdogging me? Lola, they don't even remember you. And the only reason they remember me is because I pooped out of my mouth once. I mean, how sad is this? We went to the school. These are our peers. Who cares what any of these people think about us? We graduated, remember? We are done with these idiots. Lola. College was a non-stop, inescapable popularity contest where the winners rule over an imaginary world. You think anyone in society is gonna care what they called you in college? What's gonna be etched on your metallic space crypt will be what you did in the actual real world. And the real world starts right fucking now. Everyone, hairy people, your attention please. Uh, stop, the awesome music. Is someone named Milo and Lola here? Actually, this is... That's probably two separate people. Uh, yeah. What... what is... Milo, Lola, I'm very sorry to tell you this, but both your parents were just run over by a train. What? They were scissored in half, but the wheels are keeping their guts in place. But as soon as they move the train again, their intestines will fall out of their bodies and they'll die. The EMTs are keeping them alive so you have time to be with them in their final moments. What? It's their last request. Milo, come on, they're just fucking with you. Huh? I'm so happy it's Friday, right? Thank God I don't have to do my kegels. Uh, holy... holy shit! Uh, are, are you... Oh. Oh, uh, do you... Are you... Is... what's happening to you okay? Or... Yeah. Lola, I... What? Is this a... <laughs> <laughs> oh, look at them! They, 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 they still think they're alive! They think they're alive! <laughs> what? I... What is... <laughs> look at his dumb face! Okay, what the fuck is going on? You freaks should know that my uncle's a volunteer fireman, so I can get an axe whenever I want. You want to know what's going on? Well, we'll tell you what's going on. Hey, what the hell's going on in here? Uh, Mr. Radamanthus, we were just assisting in the transition I don't between... I want to hear it. I told you guys to wash the floors with pony blood, not fuck with the newborns. Clean all this shit up. I mean it. And Milo, Lola, you're late. Luckily, there's a processor down the road. And you better double-time it if you want to get in before close. Uh, late for what? 
the wildly expensive costume ball everyone is apparently going to. Sorry to break this to you, but I'm not a parade float. What? The, what? You died. Died? Ten minutes ago. I'd head to the process station now if I were you. What the... I... Uh, okay. Let's, uh, let's go get processed. I, I don't... And the rest of you? Put all this crap away. Some evil you're, gnomes are dying in a bush crash this, tomorrow. But I, uh, we have a couple of questions. Wrong. You want the door there. I'm not a door. Go down the road. The processor will explain everything. Hey, I got tickets to the 19 Black Sox fighting a pack of wolves tonight. I can't really be doing overtime. The wolves have Toy Cobb, asshole. So spoiler alert, the Sox are losing. Get in the grooves there. It's oh my god, Nola, we're dead. We're fucking dead, and there's a god. <laughs> there's a god, and we're dead. Yeah, how did we even die? I don't even remember how we got to the party. Was there a party? What do I know? Hey. Hi, hey, how's it going? Yeah, Tuesdays are always slow. The custodians get bored. You know how it is. But the processing station's just down the way there. Start walking. You can't miss it. I can't even remember, like, when did we go to that party? Was there a party? How did we even die? I can barely remember anything. Look at this place. What, what are we even standing on? Is this a rock? Why, why is it sticking to my shoes? You know what? Screw it. I don't even... This has to be a mistake. We, we had plans. And people can't die if they have plans. Look, right now, I can maybe remember 20 full days of my whole entire life. So I can't really say with absolute certainty I didn't purposely run over a giraffe at some point. Uh, I just can't believe this is happening. Hell cannot be real. It just doesn't make any sense. It's cheating. The whole universe shouldn't be that train station where I had my socks stolen. Hey, Milo, I'm as surprised as you are, okay? My mom made me go to church until I was 12. I mean, I, I just sat there and read Mad Magazine until I stopped hearing, can I get a witness? Yes, this is wrong. Way wrong. And, and, and there better be somebody at this station whose job it is to file paperwork somewhere. And, and, and we'll, we'll get this. They'll fix it. It'll get fixed. We're, we'll be fine. Sure. Y you kind of paused there before you said sure, do you? You know that? It kind of makes it sound a little like you don't believe it. Yeah. <sighs> wait, wait, wait. Look at this. It says, The Scales of Judgment, where Osiris weighed Satan against a feather in a drunken bet to see who gained the most weight over winter break. Hey, hey, either one of you guys, Jimmy Bolanger? James Whitney Bolanger? No, neither of us are whoever you're talking about, so don't, like, hurt us, please. Wrong vocation, but don't worry, I'm not too insulted. Well, sorry to bother you. Have a good one. Hey, hey kids, hey, you wanna buy rug? Listen, I got dodecahedrons, punch bowls, uh, uh the toilet covers with St. Michael's face on them. Sorry, maybe we'll, uh, maybe we'll come back later. Yeah, they all say that. Okay. Marcy Sullivan? Marcy Sullivan. Oh, yes? Here. Here! Marcy, how you doing? Mm, not too good. Yeah, yeah, I know. Just proceed down to table three if you please. Thank you very much. Take as much. Take all day to get there. Yeah, there you go. Okay. All right, now, Lola, Lola Wolf. 
Is there a Lola wolf here? Uh, present. Ah, oh, you still have your mouth. Great. How about Sang Bong? Is Sang Bong here? Milo, you're up. Sang Bong? Uh, I... My friends usually call me Milo. Uh, a little overeager pluralizing friends there, but okay, sure. This... Okay, this is weird. It says you two are going together. Uh, what does that mean? Proceed on to table two, please. Uh, I'd like to get home before my wife gets the good spot in the garage. All right, moving, moving right along. Is there an Abby here? Table two, okay, that's, this must be us. You know, it's funny, I, I'm kind of, I feel like I'm sort of adjusting already. Like, I've just, I'm getting some level of emotional control, at least. Oh that... my god, Milo, we're dead. We're fucking dead, and we are in hell. How is this not hitting me before? We are in hell, and we are dead. Get a grip, Lola. You were the rock. Don't make me the rock. Okay, I can't be the rock. I am not fine. How was I fine? This, this is insane. Literally, the worst thing that could possibly happen to us is happening to us right now. Hi, guys. I'm Barbados. No relation to the island, which ugh, I hate that I even have to say that now. I'll be doing your personality audit before the processing commences. I have your file here on my phone. <laughs> Sorry, I'm coming from the gym. Look, we, there has, there's been a mistake. We don't, we don't even know why or how we died, so. Yeah, you know how when you're a kid, you stop remembering your infancy past a certain age? It's because your brain reconfigures itself to make more room. Ditto here. So when you pierce the mortal veil, only the important stuff stays. So, okay, so do you know how we died? I surely don't. No, sir, no, ma'am, not my department. I don't do collections. Wait, wait, make more room? For what? We're dead. And how? You're gonna be here for a very long time. Like, for eternity. And a lot of new, mostly painful memories need their baby rooms made up before delivery. Which means the spank bank is getting converted whether you like it or not. Look, I know what this is. I've seen white guys bribe hotel clerks in movies, okay? Just tell us what you want to let us go home. Hmm? Oh, sorry, I wasn't listening. Ow. Okay, this is novel, you two going together. Normally that's reserved for murder, suicides, and moms with albino sons. But we'll tag team it, all right? Answer the following questions without thinking. Milo, regardless of the truth, have you ever suspected a lover was cheating on you? There are no wrong answers. Well, except that one. Uh... Actually, it's hard to remember, but I want to say, yeah, I think I have. You think you have? Okay, cool. All right, Lola. Which image is closest to representing what was your ideal life? Uh, okay, even though I'm sure this is a trap, the exec running shit. <laughs> I would have guessed that one for you. Ooh, I would have. That's so funny. You guys, can I just say, you're doing really well. Really? <laughs> oh. Come the fuck on, man. Okay, you see that head over there? Uh-huh. I, I mean... <laughs> Alright, fling that thing up into the hamper like you're George Gervin. Good hand-eye coordination. I'll put you down as functioning mammal. Lightning oh. round! This is a word association, so just say the first thing that pops into your head. Ring. Uh, whatever. Lola, drugs. No, thank you. Milo, crowds. Joy? Milo, I mean, Lola, break. Like, breaking bones? Ho, ho, ho! What could this be, hmm? All the way from the deepest, darkest broom closets of your mind! Lola, what? The reigning pride of your ceaseless sorrow! The sultan of revulsion! The drain on your brain! That pebble in your shoe you just can't get out! I give you your personal demon! How in 
tarnation are you, man? I'm just so excited to be working with you, with anyone, really. It's just, I am so ready for this shit. We're gonna be a team, a real partnership. I want you to know that, oh crap, there's two of you? I, I'm so sorry, little lady, I didn't see you there. Let, uh, oh, let me start over, okay? Whew. I'm Sister Mary Wormhorn, and I will be assisting you guys with your mental anguish here in hell. We're gonna be brain bunkmates. You're hungry, I'm hungry, you're sad, I'm... I mean, that means I'm doing my job. <laughs> yeah, hi. Oh, hi! Sister Wormhorn here is your personal demon. Slow down, Barbados, what does that mean? Well, it's a comfort inhibitor only you and other demons can see. And it's so during your off hours, there's still somebody to nudge you into traffic sometimes. Off hours? Okay. Well, what, is, uh, what does that mean? Yeah, Dev, no. The fact that you only ate free-range chicken doesn't change anything. Okay, now that you have all been appointed your personal demons, we can now assign you your torture. Your torture will take place during regular office hours by a certified sadist. Exempting holidays and Medusa's birthday, even though I don't know why we bother that. Office hours? Do we... do people get, like, time off? Hey, Norma Ray, it ain't for the people, it's for the demons. You think getting whipped for ten hours is hard? Try swinging the cat of nine tails all the live long day. You'll pray to trade seats. Abigail Cunningham? Yes? Your bones will be broken every day by a ball peen hammer for the sin of repeatedly misusing the express lane in grocery stores. But I always have more than 15 things. Ah! Oh my god, Milo, she's. Dev Sedona and Marcy Sullivan. Uh, no. It's you. I, we just did this like two minutes ago. Milo, this is it. Okay, this is, we gotta get out of here. Lola, what the hell do you think we can even... Now, for robbing all those liquor stores, Dev will be suspended from a pole by his genitals. What? While children use your head like a tetherball, weather permitting. Marcy, your tits will be consumed by snapping turtles, only for them to regrow larger every day, giving you intense back pain when you jog. But, but, we, we only rob Jewish liquor stores. <laughs> Now, Milo and Lola, for the sin of... For the sin of being too late to get assigned to punishment, you get to wander the city until tomorrow. Have fun, see you later, I'm going to get drunk. Wait, um, what is, what's our thing gonna be, our, our torture? Our hours are nine to six, guys. Can't you just tell us now? Come back in the morning when we're open. Okay, but, but what are we supposed to do until then? Sightsee, meet people, might as well carve out your shitting hole. And hey, don't worry, you'll be having maggots forced up your nose soon enough. Well, what the hell are we supposed to do now? Hey, what? you two could have told me that guy got another ride. What? Bowlinger. Jimmy? I was looking for him earlier. The guy got another ride, that's all. You could have fucking told me. Huh? The guy got another... ride? Are you like his... his friend? I'm just fucking with you. Sorry, you're confused. Uh, it's... I'm... I'm being mean. Okay. I'm a psychopomp. Friend of Urshanabi, Tooth of Fligius, Charon's lost dog. Uh-huh. I'm a... I'm a cab driver. A ferryman, to be, uh, specific. Oh, a psychopomp! Uh, I'm sure the answer to this is no, but can you, like, ferry us out of here? That... Depends. Where do you want to go? Um, home, topside, Earth, if if that's if if that's possible. Home. Hmm. The props assist the house until the house is built. Yeah, doctors do warn you that you don't get to take the drapes when that fastball catches the side of your head. You're saying we're stuck here. She's saying we're stuck here. No, it's it's just it's a tall order. That's all. Look, I just clocked in, but I need a fare. You guys look clean enough. 
You want to roll with me on a chore I got to do? It's at first an Izzard. I got to see about a friend, but I'll introduce you to some people. Huh? I'm Sam, by the way. Sam Hill. Short for Samantha. Short for Silithial Machidial. Milo. Lola. Mr. Milo? Miss Lola? I'm nicer than I look. What do you say? Again, the same feeling I did when that guy in the van tried to sell me a raccoon. I'm choosing to trust this. What the fuck else are you gonna do with your night, right? Come on, my ride's this way. Won't be a long trip. Uh, so, uh... Hell, huh? Yeah, the days have worn away, haven't they? I can tell you cats were new. Dead-eyed and pig-tailed. So I guess I'll hit the questions everyone has. First of all, whatever church you went to, whatever faith, they... Ah, <sighs> here's my little bundle of joy. I should give her a name. Never really had the time, though. Or the desire. Hop on in, but mind the leather. Oh, okay. It's, uh, the, the seat's wet. Oh, yeah, that's probably your... Okay, everybody in? Great. So, you're dead, you're in hell, it's bewildering, I know, but like moving to a new place or cutting up a body, it's best to just focus on one thing at a time. So, for instance, what the fuck are we driving on right now? This is the River Styx. It's an immaterial, trans-dimensional spear course that connects all the little islands of hell and provides fairy women like me a job. It used to cost money. Huh, I thought the River Styx was a myth, like cat outfits that they actually enjoy wearing. What you think of hell is what's called the Nine Circles. The, uh, conurbation, where everyone gets tortured during Punch-In. But outside the Nine Circles is an infinite chain of islands we call Nowhere. And it's what you're in now. God's coloring book, I guess you could say? Everything comes from the abstract. The abyss. The outer realm where he set his dark materials. It's a long story. Longer than we have time for. Right now, at least. But hang tight. We're almost there. Okay, here we are. Watch your step getting off. I know sometimes you kids like to play at the shore, but you fuckers sink fast, so... And I ran out of the house without my flippers today, so just keep your eyes on each other's toes. Hey, I played water polo in gym class voluntarily, okay? Milo and I can egg beat her like our lives depend on it. I'm sure you can, Lola. I'm, I'm sure that if you were on the Titanic, we'd have a lot more Polish people today. But things are a little hey, different hey, here, Sam, so just do what I say Sam. and stick- What? Did you, did you hear the one about the blind guy who walked into a bar? He walked into the table and shares next. <laughs> Get some better material. How? So, not that either of you asked, but this is first an Izzard. I think the tourism board calls it the bludgeoning capital of nowhere. So, uh, use that information as you will. Just don't shake everybody's hand, is what I'm saying. And look at people's shoes when you talk to them. First an Izzard? Why is it called First and Izzard? How the hell am I supposed to know? Why is New York called New York? It's named after the Duke of York. Oh, thanks, Brainiac. Why don't you lecture us on what a rhetorical question is next? Wait, why'd we come here? If it's so dangerous... I mean, these are the types of people you think we should know? Um, what are you guys eating? Uh, no, whoever he was, he tastes like a prick. Hey, excuse me. We're trying not to get dumbass all over our pants here. I warned you like 18 goddamn times. You'll get your stomach back when you learn to behave. Sam, hey, how's it going? Eh, pretty good, pretty good. Is, uh, Forney in there? Fornius, yeah. He's fiddling with his dick somewhere. All the kids with you? Yeah, they're cute, right? I'm playing tour guide on my coffee break. All right, well, anything happens, I get their hair. Okie smokey, who's drinking? Cause I'm buying. Just kidding, you can drink for free, cause we're in hell. So we're gonna be all right in there, right? Sure, just uh, tuck your arms into your shirt sleeves. So, whenever you're ready. The door is just right here for entry into the first bar of your magical adventure. Where we can drink! 
And talk more. And everything will progress. Here goes nothing. A bottle for everyone. Is that crazy? It's fun, right? My balls hadn't dropped yet. How would I think that was funny? Boom. Just drink it. Don't even well, look at me. Well, if it isn't the smelliest pile of puke in all of nowhere, Samantha Hill. How the heck fire are you? Hey, Forney. Perfect timing. Guys, this is Forneus. Forneus, this is Milo and Lola. So you adopted two human children, and those are the names you gave them? I didn't pick their names. But you did adopt them. They're not mine. We're not kids, all right? I got a savings account and everything. Tommy's having his party upstairs. Want a drink? You read my mind. Wait, Sam. Relax. We'll get into your thing in a bit. Just follow me. Uh, uh, no, all right. Fornius, with one F, and we're just going upstairs to a Tommy's death day party. See you up there, kids. Um, excuse me. Private party. But our friend just went up. Sam, she's on the list. You ain't. You don't even know our names. How do you know we're not on the list? I'm looking at you. That's more than enough information. Tommy boy, the man of the hour. <laughs> hey, Father Van Dyke. Get over here. I got a new cocktail I need reviewed. Well, I'll happily be your willing test pilot. I think that's the guy having the party upstairs. Are you thinking what I'm thinking? Uh, get him to invite us up. Get him to invite us up, yes. Let's get a drink. All right, Tommy. Sorry for the wait. What can I get you? Ah, oh, jeez. I don't know. What's, uh, what do you recommend? Top shelf. A case of lung batter just came in. Excuse me, barkeep. We would like a... Uh... Hey, can't you stupid pieces of shit see there's a conversation happening here? <laughs> Van Dyke, it's okay. They're new. You're new, right? How you liking hell so far? Was the suicide pact worth it? Or uh, eating 50 raw eggs? It's not the the worst place I've been to. That gas station off of Fremont? Oh, it's still, you know. I mean, I don't know about you, Milo, but I've seen scarier versions of hell and tales from the crypt. <laughs> Let's be fair. It's scary. I'm scared. I don't... Nobody take it as a challenge. She's Lola. I'm Milo. We're actually just trying to... Wait, 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 wait. You're new. We gotta have a toast. Do a shot with me. Come on. Van Dyke, three brass bulls, if you please. Sure thing. If you ate before you got here, and sure, our livers are unkillable. Might as well take advantage. Wow, really? Guys, you should be honored. Lola is not the type for spontaneous, uh, revelry. <laughs> Perfect. Let's go. Okay, cats and jammer kids, listen up. Above ground booze is watered down milk, but here, this shit ain't 2%. Father Van Dyke's been serving alcohol since Jesus was still overcharging for kitchen cabinets. Around the bend. Let's go. Cheers. Ah, <laughs> uh, goes down smooth. Now, you should notice you feel a little empowered, right? Maybe a little freer? Or if you have eyeballs, you'll notice you have an extra choice floating around in your brain. Hey, you're right. Feels kind of weird. Like I grew an extra toe. You'll get used to it. But be careful what you order. Different drinks affect people different ways. Like, you know, for instance... Hey, Jim Jum! What the fu- What the shit is that you got on your head? <laughs> uh, sir, I I'm not, uh, Jim Jum. Yeah, sure you are! Jim Jum! <laughs> Why, I even called you, you last, uh, yesterday morning? At night? Hey, dickhead! Get the hell out of my friend's face before you start pissing me off! Jesus, you, you don't have to raise your voice at me! I know when I'm not wanted, I can I can read body languages. Where's the latrine anyway? See you later. See? Having an extra little bit of confidence can really help keep the sailing smooth down here. Or, you know, it can get the shit kicked out of you. Whichever side the coin lands on. But like I was saying, grass bulls tend to make people a little ornery. But try different drinks for different results. Christ, they sound like a fucking car commercial. 
Tete, Tommy, are we having a rematch or have your balls not grown back yet? <laughs> hey, I'm coming over there, all right? Nice meeting you kids. Crap, we should... We're missing our chance, we should go ask him, right? I mean, he's our ticket upstairs to Sam and, uh, her info. Um, yeah, but we should probably get a drink first. Don't have to twist my arm. Uh, barkeep? What's, uh, on the menu this tomorrow's eve? A fine selection, let me tell you. Amethian sounds pretty cool. A great Amethian. All right. Girly, what's your poison? Uh, just same as him, I guess. Uh, I thought, don't the demons torture the humans? How come everyone's just hanging out like it's happy hour at Chili's? Look, nobody here wants to be doing what they're doing. It's a job, and people understand that. Most people. And when your shift's over, you drink with whatever dangling eyeballs in front of you. The nicer ones, anyway. It's a job? Then who's the boss? I'll give you a hint. He co-wrote the Bible with Santa Claus. It's the big I am. The million dollar man. God. I thought we were friends. How could you not tell me? Why would I need to tell you dolls can't really talk? Can it, you two? I warned you once already. One more outburst, you and everyone near you are getting their feet nailed to the top of Mount Vasectomy. Oh, wait, maybe we should just egg those two idiots on. The bouncer will have to deal with it, and then we can go upstairs. The bouncer will have to... How do you even know that'll happen? Doesn't that seem, like, advanced? Hey. Hey, fellas. Beer pong, huh? Uh, my, my dorm room was next to the guy who won his league tournament. That's awesome. You know what would be even more awesome? If you could stop talking and never start again. Hey now, Artesia's consumer of negligent fathers, that's not cool. Milo, right? You want to play around? It's really simple. <laughs> Easy to learn, hard to master, right? I've, uh, never played before. Is it like normal pong? Because in that, the ball bounces back. You catch on quick. Did you die drinking bleach thinking it was just really painful water? Uh, look, it's easy. Lola, okay. You and me, Bright Eyes. I'm going to wreck you. Lola? Do you want to, uh... To play? Let's dance. Fuck him up, Lola. Gather round, everyone. This chickadee thinks she's a rooster already. Well, I eat people who eat roosters for breakfast. Ooh. Hey, all right. You make more well-wishers with honey than with vinegar. <laughs> No, it's okay, guys. We really pride ourselves on our ability to trash talk down here. It's like, even if you lose, if you got in a few verbal jabs along the way, a few witty rejoinders... Yeah, so take your shot, shithead. Or we can just call each other names, you know, whichever's faster. Oh, are you chicken now? You got lucky in hell once a century, so I hope that was worth it. Don't miss. There we go. You can do it! Yep. Does your family know you're this bad at this? Because someone should tell them. Hey, shouldn't there be an Amber Alert right about now? This asshole's skills are missing. Come on. <laughs> Come on, Lola. Someone put her out of her misery. Throw some Jesus. Strike strikes? What is it called when it goes in? Enjoying this yet? Can 
do it, Lola. Awesome. Oh. Just throw the thing in the thing, Lola, and you'll have done what you should. Oof, close. Eat my shit, goddammit. Picture victory, and victory will be yours. Nice! I cannot believe this shit. My arm was tired from stabbing and eating fathers all day. Hey, come on, good game, man. You kept it... close? Oh, please, you flatten him. He can't remember where his fucking house is! Oh, my God! This is going to ruin my whole week. <laughs> Man, you got the luck of a white Protestant, kid. I'm inviting them, all right? Eh, they're goofy-looking enough. You guys want to hang out more? I'm throwing a little party upstairs. Just tell the big guy your name, and I'll put you on the list. Awesome. Thanks. You're awesome. Let's go get Sam before he looks at us again and changes his mind. Need a drink? Uh, sure. Uh, two grave robbers. What kind of whiskey? Well, if I knew I would get the third degree, I wouldn't have even bothered. What can I get you? A pair of anguish, I think. something good sir i believe we're on the list your parents must be proud hey you know we we should be friends seriously I mean, what's your name do you do you have a name do demon bouncers have names or are you like like a doorknob or something i hate this job come on buddy let's keep the pogo stick hopping This, uh, wait, is this even the same bar? Welcome, welcome to Tommy Tulaney's Death Day Celebration. I saw you two talking to Tommy downstairs. Are you a victim or a fan? Wait, but it won't take long. How do you know it won't take long? Something like this could take all fucking week. <clears throat> Lady, gentlemen. Farney. Gah, that guy. You give him an inch, he takes a really long conversation. Sorry that took a while. How'd you even get up here? We sort of made friends with Thomas, the Night Scalper Tulaney, so... Yay! Lola beat his buddy in Blood Pong. Wow, I'm impressed. You're a little old for Tulaney. You know, but with Milo's head of hair, I can... I can see the appeal, actually. Hey! We're... we're cool, okay? I... I... uh... I... Yeah, you obviously died jet skiing with, with supermodels. I... We can see that now. Listen, Sam, it's been a fun uh, hour or however long we've been here, but we really, we really want to get out, if possible. We just, we want to go home. See that big mansion down the way? The one having the party? That's Satan's house. He throws a rager every night, invites the fucking universe, tries to keep everybody's spirits up. You see, Hell's been in a bit of a low period recently. And by recently, I mean like the last thousand years. Nowhere in the Nine Circles, they used to be a place of, you know, creativity. Of uncompromised refusal to go to bed when you're told. We were the scribbled-in margins in God's field guide, you know? And now, well, now people just like to get shit-faced. And I don't really know who we are anymore. Oh, so hell's terrible. Is that what you're saying? Why am I not shocked? I'm telling you this because it deserves context. What deserves context? 
You see, chums, there's one old practice that's stayed around. And Satan has a standing offer to anyone that wants to try. You outdrink him, you outparty him, you earn his respect. He opens the door and lets you go back home. Back to Earth. Alive. To do whatever you want to do until you die of something else. Okay, well, has anyone ever, like, done it? Oh, sure. I mean, not since... When was Buddha farting around again? 500 years before Christ. Okay, well, there you go. And I think there was a velociraptor before him. Okay, so, yeah, okay, um, but you're saying the only way out of hell is out drink the Prince of Lies? We call him the Prince of Partying down here, but yes, you have to out party the Prince of Partying. Okay. Lola, Milo, welcome to the show. Now, if you don't mind, I got other fares to pick up, so if you want to head to Lucifer's, now's the time. Well, there's nothing else to do, so yeah, let's go.